Oh, oh God, there he is. Oh God, this might be a big boy here, boys. He hit it in deep water. What's up guys? We just had a cold front come through in South Georgia, but today's video is brought to you by Crawl's Bait and Tackle. So this month, I got this awesome tackle box right here. This thing is sweet. It is the Ike edition. I got a bunch of Guggen baits. I got all kind of awesome stuff. So I'm gonna put the link in the description down below for you guys to get over to Crawl's Bait and Tackle and check it out. Let's go. Oh, there he is. There he is. There he is. I got him. I got him. It's a bass. It's a bass. Well, I caught me a bass with a fritz side five. I've been catching fish with this thing everywhere. Everywhere I go. Oh, there's one. There, here's one. I think it's a little bass. <laughs> Check him out. This is a tiny little bass. Tiny little thing. Let's throw him back. Oh, there he is. Oh, oh, it's a big bass. It's a big bass. Come on up here, baby. Come on up here. Yes. Come on up here. <laughs> Check him out. Guys, that's a solid one there. That's probably a three pounder. And what I was doing, I was yo-yoing it. Pulled it up, let it fall, pulled it up, let it fall. And then whenever I went to pick up on it, he was on there. He grabbed it. He's a good one. We got us a good bass, boys. He's probably three pounds. Let's throw her back. So this is a seven eighths ounce ripping wrap purple clown color i got it from crawl's bait and tackle once again the link to crawl's bait and tackle is in the description all you got to do is search rip and wrap seven eighths ounce purple clown now <clears throat> i've got 30 pound braid with a five foot 17 pound monofilament leader on here this is a 74 medium heavy moderate fast tip rod which is what i use for chatter baiting and what i was using for flipping but lately i've been using it for yo-yo in this big rattle trap so the 7 8 ounce rattle trap, it's really big. And with it having a slim profile, you gotta reel it really fast to keep that thing going. This is an 831 gear ratio reel. Now I can reel this reel fast enough to keep this thing going, but the fish haven't been reacting to fishing it fast like that. Most of the bites I've been getting, fishing this big ripping wrap, no matter where I go, it's yo-yoing it. Throw it out, let it sink to the bottom. Pull up on it, let it sink again. And just keep doing that. The reason I like doing that with the ripping wrap, it's got that flat profile. And it falls, it flutters almost like a spoon does. <clears throat> it's probably my favorite lipless crankbait for yo-yoing. Another plus using this high gear ratio reel and the 7.4 rod. The longer rod allows me to get longer pulls whenever I'm yo-yoing it so I can pull it up higher. That means it has more fall time. And with this 8.21 gear ratio reel, I can turn that reel just a little bit and add a little extra length to my pump. Let me show you guys what I mean. So I hit the bottom, I'm gonna pull up and then I'll turn the handle right into the pool. Pull up and then turn the handle right into the pool. So that makes it come up a little bit higher, gives it more fall time, 
and if the bass are hitting it on the fall, then it gives them more time to grab it. Oh God, there he is. Oh God. This might be a big boy here, boys. He hit it in deep water. Oh yeah, this is gonna be a tank. Oh, he's pulling out drag. Oh my God. This might be an eight pounder, guys. Oh, he's big, he's big. Come on up here now. Whoo, so much fun catching him with the yo-yo on the braid. The ripping wrap. Hooked him in the side of the head. That's what's going on. That is a solid one though. Jeez. Alright. Heck yeah. Alright, this is a big healthy bass right here. You can see she's eating good and she's getting fat for winter, so we caught her, we seen her, she fought good. Let's let her go. So big and fat and pretty. Look at that. Look at that big fat pretty bass guys. Jeez all. Oh. All right, that's what I'm talking about. If you like this video, please hit that thumbs up, drop a comment down below. Don't forget to subscribe and we'll see you again next time.